In the world of magic, half the fun is being tricked by sleight of hand. Now you see it, now you don't. Our inability to follow the action is key to the magician's success. This is not what we want from our roads and highways, however, where the inability to follow the action can lead to disaster. The fact is, although more people are driving than ever before, average speeds have increased and there are more miles of roadway in use than at any time in history. Essential fundamental safety is at times being neglected by not providing proper roadway markings that could help reduce accidents and save lives. And it's happening right before your eyes. Everyone agrees on the important safety function of roadway markings. The federal government has established uniform standards for markings that local, county, and state governments across the nation comply with. Roadway markings are the horizontal signage in this safety system. They mark center lines and lanes, edges of the road, the intended path, the delineation of road types, crosswalks and safety concerns. Roadway markings are the unfolding traveling road map for the driver. Unfortunately, in too many cases, these crucial visual pathways are disappearing into thin air. A black hole is the most dramatic of these conditions and the most dangerous. This is where roadway markings virtually don't exist. It may be only for a few feet or a few blocks, but nonetheless, the most dangerous of situations. The roadway markings are the vigilant sentries of safety, operating 24 hours a day, seven days a week, in good visibility and poor, in all kinds of weather. Yet they are often poorly maintained, worn out and fading, so that when they're most needed, they don't function. This is critical. In winter, with roads in poor driving condition, more night hours, often with glare and reduced visibility. On rural roads with low levels of light. On city streets with confusing visual clutter. The fact is every driver will benefit from improved and well-maintained roadway markings, especially the impaired driver who is involved in most traffic accidents and fatalities. Who is the impaired driver? Obviously, those driving under the influence of alcohol and drugs, they shouldn't be on the road, but they are. But more visible markings might stop them in time from having an accident. But in a larger sense, any driver who has trouble seeing the road is an impaired driver, a stranger who doesn't know the area, mom or dad with a car full of active kids, the driver who left his glasses at work, or the one under medication for a cold. A tired driver, a driver of an oversized vehicle, or a driver who is emotionally under stress. And as the number of drivers over 60 continues to grow, the need for more visible and, in some situations, wider roadway markings becomes more important than ever. Older drivers are leading more active lives, and they're more mobile than ever. That's the good news. But research shows that drivers over 60 need signs and markings three times brighter than a driver age 20. And our road safety is not always keeping pace. Studies also show that the most cost-effective investment in traffic safety is improved roadway markings, maintained to the highest acceptable standard. Today, however, the standards of performance are very inconsistent from locale to locale, state to state. Our roadways are simply not as safe as they could be, even though the need is greater than ever and the costs appear justifiable and effective in saving lives and reducing property loss. This is especially apparent in construction work zones. We have reached an age where our nation's highways are in need of nearly constant maintenance and renovation in the midst of everyday traffic with high speeds and shifting lane conditions. The numbers are startling. According to the National Highway Transportation Safety Administration, deaths in construction work zones have risen 50% in recent years. The root of the problem is not a lack of concern. 
In most cases, it is simply a lack of awareness on the part of government agencies and, just as importantly, on the part of the public. But it's a problem that won't go away by waving a wand and snapping our fingers. There is a need for government agencies to establish and conform to minimum maintenance standards so that markings that are in place are durable and in quality condition. The Federal Highway Administration is currently developing minimum standards to help get this problem in check. European countries such as France and Germany are leading the way in the area of improved standards. As drivers, we tend to take roadway markings for granted, but that can be an illusion. We may not see the problem until it's pointed out, even though it is right there before our very eyes. Changing technology offers your governmental agency many ways in which to keep roadway markings visible to motorists. They may opt for existing materials with frequent restriping. An increased schedule of maintenance is needed here to provide a constant level of effective delineation. Or they may choose more advanced, durable materials such as preformed tapes, thermoplastics, epoxies, or raised pavement markers. Today's products and systems offer better durability, so they are always there to guide you with improved reflective properties even in the rain, better contrast with the road surface, and skid resistance for improved pedestrian safety at crosswalks. Today's advanced technology has given us new design and manufacturing techniques that deliver measurably higher brightness levels even in adverse weather conditions. An example is the use of raised markers as a supplement to standard pavement markings. There are high visibility, temporary markings designed specifically for the construction work zone. The bottom line is, roadways can be safer. The technology exists with products that are cost effective, of high quality, with greater durability, and which provide enhanced performance. That's good news for drivers of any age. There is no trick to solving this. It will take everyone's effort. At the American Traffic Safety Service Association, we're doing our part as a group of concerned professionals in the pavement marking industry. Our mission is to help increase awareness of the important role pavement markings play in traffic safety and to raise a concern that this important safety issue needs the attention and involvement of the public and government agencies. We see more miles of the American road. We know from first-hand experience that there are ways to improve the visibility of roadway markings and in the process save lives and reduce property losses. For everyone who drives, this is an issue they can relate to directly. Everyone who is driven at night or in bad weather, in a strange city, on a dark highway, everyone who is concerned about impaired drivers on the road. Ultimately, it will be informed and involved people who will provide the impetus for long-term improvements in this crucial area, to establish visibility and maintenance standards, to insist on the investment in the best available technology and its upkeep. The Congress of the United States has passed legislation to help fund this effort. Now it's up to concerned individuals to help put those resources to work. Sometimes the solution is not at all apparent. We don't know which way to turn. The puzzle is too complex. But that's not the case with roadway markings. The technology and products exist. The roads can be safer for those who drive today and those who will be driving in the years to come. The answers are right before your eyes.